Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a haul video. It's just some things that I've purchased over the last couple of weeks to help me bring in the fall season. So I'm just going to jump right into it. It's kind of all over the place. I went to Sephora. I went to Nordstrom also. So yeah, it's just going to be from Nordstrom and Sephora. Sephora had their VIB sale and I purchased a couple of things through that sale and then I went back and got some things after the sale was over and I got a few things from Nordstrom which I said already so let's just jump right into it so I will start with the two Becca products that I got well first I'll do like the little samples from Sephora I just got this 100 point perk and it's by Benefit and it's the what's up it's just like this mini highlighter. You actually get a lot of product, which I was surprised. So this is just a nice highlight. I think that's so pretty. The only thing is it when it when you blend it out, it blends out a little weird. I don't know. It doesn't blend out as smoothly as I thought it would. So, I don't know. I think I might have to try and work with it. But I do think that it's a pretty highlight. I got two products from Becca. And it's just two of their highlights. And I got the pressed ones. It's the Shimmering Skin Perfectors. I got Rose Gold and Topaz. This one I actually started to use. This one is Topaz. This highlight is beautiful. Look at that. It's so pretty on darker skin tones. It blends out nicely. It's just like the nicest natural highlight. So I really, really like this. I found myself wanting to use this every day. Then I also got Rose Gold. I went back after I got the first one to get Rose Gold. And Rose Gold is just what it says. It's like a pretty Rose Gold. And again, I feel like this looks really nice on dark skin or darker skin tones. So this is rose gold. Blend it out. Do you see that? It's so pretty on. These are so finely milled. They go on effortlessly. And even if you like put too much, it's not a bad. Like you know how sometimes when you put on a highlighter it can look like too cakey or it won't blend out well? Not with this. With this it blends out so nicely. So I really, really like these. If you haven't tried a Becca highlight, try one. You won't be disappointed. Then I got this like sample size of the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. I tried it and I mean, to me it's just like any other primer that's like silicone based. So, I, I wasn't totally impressed with this. So, yeah. And for $15, this small amount, I don't think that I'll be purchasing that again. I got the Anastasia Brow Wiz. And I got it in medium brown, medium ash. I was going to get brunette, but brunette was just a little dark. So, it made my eyebrows kind of harsh. But this one, I found wasn't really bad so it just winds up like this and it's just like a natural kind of filler to your brows so I really liked how this worked and I really really like the spoolie on the end it really comes out and separates those hairs in your brow so I was really happy with this 
I also got two products from NARS. I got the NARS Audacious Lipstick and I got it in Live. Because I really wanted to get a lipstick from this collection. And I was like, what shade should I get? I have lots of nudes. Why not get a darker vampy color because I don't have much of those. This is how the packaging looks. Ooh. And it's like a magnetic closure. And this is the shade that I got. It's just a nice vampy shade. It's actually the shade that I have on right now. And it's just like a nice deep plum. It says NARS on the lipstick. I always wanted to get Cyber by MAC, but it always looked really terrible on me. So this color kind of reminded me of Cyber. So that's why I picked up this one. Oh, my time. Then I got another Kat Von D liquid lipstick. And I got this one in the shade Lolita. And it's actually close to the shade of my nails. I love these things. They last all day long. They don't move. They have great coverage. And they're matte. I love these. This is Lolita right there. It's just like the perfect nudie mauve shade. It's like a mauve brown, kind of. I really, really like this lipstick. I got two more NARS products. I got this from Nordstrom, and this is the from the laser cut, like, holiday collection that they have. And this was $59. Oh, I wasn't even saying the prices of anything else. So I'm not going to say the prices of anything else. Because I don't remember the prices of everything. But I really wanted something from this collection. And this was kind of the only thing that I felt suited me. So it just opens like this. And in it you get three eyeshadows. And then you get the Dolce Vita lip gloss. So you get these pretty eyeshadows. I already tried this out today. I actually used it for my makeup for the day. But I've already wiped all my makeup off. So I'll just swatch these three shades for you. These are the three shades of the eyeshadows. They're very pigmented. It's like a nice neutral green. And then like a shimmery gold. And then a matte cream. So again, these are the shades that you get. And then when you lift that up. And you look underneath. You get a blush and a bronzer. The bronzer I'm going to use as a like pressed powder and then the blush is like a pretty shimmery like peachy kind of pink shade. I'll swatch those for you. Oh I definitely use like my green finger for the blush. Yeah I already had things on my finger when I swatched that. Those swatches aren't going to come out well. I'll do it on this side. So, can you see that? No, you can't. Ah, let's do That's the blush and the bronzer. I dropped the lip gloss. This is the lip gloss. It's like a deluxe sample size of the Dolce Vita. And it's so super pigmented. This is Dolce Vita. I'm actually thinking of getting the larger size to this lip gloss. Because it's the prettiest color ever. And you get all of these for $59. And I feel that that's a pretty good price. Because you're getting like to sample all these different things. 
you're getting to sample three eyeshadows and you're getting to sample this pretty blush I could live without the bronzer I'd rather have two blush colors or just one large blush than this but hey that's fine also so that's that from NARS all in all I thought this was a cute little set and this is gonna be great for travel because you're gonna have like a blush and an eyeshadow and your lip color so I think that I'm gonna have fun traveling with that the last NARS product that I got is the NARS contour blush and I got it in the shade Gina which is the darkest shade So this is the shade Gina. And I've been loving this contour powder. Like it's that subtle kind of contour that my black radiance gives me. So it's like a nice subtle contour like this. It's not too much. A little bit does go a long way. So this is how it looks on my finger. Excuse that one. And I'll swatch it right there. So this is the swatch of Gina. It's just like a nice subtle contour. You can build it up more if you want. I didn't rub it hard enough. But like you can build it up. I really like this. As for being a contour and a blush, I don't know who would use this shade as a blush. I mean, maybe you can, but I wouldn't. So the next time I do look for this, I'm going to try to look for just this shade as the contour only. So I really like that. And the last thing, yes, the last thing that I got was this Buxom Winner Takes All lip gloss set. And I love Buxom lip glosses. I got a sample in the Give Me Lip or Give Me More Lip palette from Sephora. And I was just like, oh my gosh, this is the best lip gloss ever. So I decided to get this so that I could have more. One Buxom lip gloss. I'm not sure how much one large one is I think it's like $20 so for $32 you get two four six of the deluxe sample size so I thought that was pretty good because if like two equals one then you're getting like three it's like getting three large ones for $32 and one is like 20 so this is a great value they're all different shades I'll swatch like two of them for you and they have some have like these frosty bottles and then some have clear bottles this one is Trixie they all kind of show up sheer on me but these are the lip glosses that just like it has like some plumper like activity going on on the lips and these are great to wear over lipsticks that you want to have a more shine to and sometimes you want a matte lip sometimes you don't so these are great for those occasions this one though when I do put it on it is kind of opaque on the lips let's do three I don't want to do all of them I'll just do three of them. But these are three shades. This one here is Sophia. Then this one is Trixie. It's like a sparkly peach. And then the one in the middle is Berry Blast. And I really like these lip glosses. I love how they feel on the lips. They're nice and smooth. They aren't too sticky. 
and they just give the perfect amount of sheen to your lips and I like the fact that they have like the lip the lip plumper in them but it's not like too overbearing it's like just the right amount it's like the perfect lip gloss so these are going to be great to have like in my purse on my dresser just anywhere so I really really like this and it's a great value again so that's what I got and I hope you guys enjoy this video and let me know if you guys went and took advantage of the Sephora VIB sale or the things that you've been getting to bring you into this upcoming holiday season. I'll see you guys again soon. Bye guys.